Hey y'all! Hey, my name is Zim Bureza and I'm 15 years old. I'm Lebanese and I have been studying in Antonine International School for as long as I could remember. I have a twin brother and an older sister. And my doggy. I have a lot of hobbies, like a lot. I've been playing the piano since I was like 8 years old. I also play the drums in a band. Other than that, I love to sing, so I'm a vocalist in another band. <laughs> Other than music, I also participate in a lot of sports. For example, I'm the goalkeeper and the captain of the girls' futsal team in school. And I also play in a Lebanese football club. Moving on to my interests. Everything related to art fascinates me. For instance, I'm a makeup and fashion freak. <laughs> Trying new and weird looks are my thing. I always like to express myself. Changing my hairstyle, getting new piercings. I have 10 piercings. I have seven on my right ear, and I have two on my left ear, and I have one on my left eyebrow. Or getting a new tattoo are all different ways of expressing myself and letting myself free. I also like doing different activities, ones that not everyone dares to do, like paragliding, skydiving, and long hikes, and many others. I also like to challenge myself to the extreme. My dream and my goal is to become a pilot. And that is because I love traveling and exploring new places and meeting new people. And because female pilots are uncommon, I believe that it is a great challenge, yet a great opportunity for me. And especially that in Lebanon there's only one female pilot. And I'm the second. For me, CAS is a very interesting and fun thing to do since I spend most of my time doing activities. I also believe that CAS will help me become a better and more productive person. I hope that through CAS, I could help people more through community service and inspire people to follow their dreams by showing them my love and commitment to the activities I enjoy doing and through my creativity. I hope that these two years would be full of experiences and success. Thank you.